Today we are on the road as you can see and that's because we are on our way to pick up our new farm dog. And to do that we have to drive almost 200 miles from where we live. So let's get to it. On the western side of Norway there are many fjords and mountains that split the landscape. That meant that we had to cross many bridges, go through many tunnels and also take some ferries. We also took the time to stop and buy some equipment and toys for the new dog. The weather on the coast of Norway can be unpredictable, so we had all from heavy hail, high winds, to blue sky and sun. After a few hours, the landscape changed into the flatter parts of the south of Norway. That meant that we were getting close. So it's a few hours later and we have uh, collected the puppy. Uh, I didn't want to film in somebody's private home, so that part we didn't, we didn't cover. But uh, right now he's sleeping in the back and I'm not going to go back and disturb him. So you will all meet him when we get back home in another few hours. And so this is Theo, and he's an 8 week year old golden retriever. The reason we chose this breed is that they are loyal, athletic and good family dogs. Especially in regards to our daughter's condition, it is important that the dog is calm and patient around children. Golden retrievers are known for their calm nature. On our farm, Theo will help us keep predators away from our chickens and spring lambs when he gets older. The urine of a large male dog is often enough to scare away predators like foxes and ferrets. The main reason we got him is not to be a guard dog, as golden retrievers tend to love everybody. He will mainly be a family dog and a companion on our farm. So this takes off one of the boxes in the plan to create the farm of our dreams. And if you want to follow our journey, then remember to hit that subscribe button and I will be seeing you on the next video. Bye for now. Ow!